San Francisco 49ers. 49ers. Excuse me. Yeah. San Francisco 49ers. I don't know why I keep on saying the Cardinals. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, 49ers last year had a 6-10 and 10 record. Currently, they are sitting with $15 million in cap space. The recent transaction was releasing offensive lineman Weston Richburg. Um, as far as key free agents this year, Trent Williams, Richard Sherman, uh, J- Jaworski Tart. Um, one thing I did want to highlight as far as the San Francisco 49ers, as far as 2020 is concerned, uh, they had a lot of season ending injuries due to uh, Nick Bosa, Richard Sherman, um, just a lot of injuries across the board, which prevented them from being a playoff contender, basically going feeding off of their the previous year of the Super Bowl run. So keep that in mind when you when you when we when we discuss the San Francisco 49ers. But um again 15 point 15.3 million dollars in cap space. Uh which I what you guys think? Well number one thing is they don't have a single uh cornerback under contracts so i think they need to uh, shape up that defense to back or cornerback specifically so that's one um i don't know if i would make a change at quarterback i because everybody's talking about garofalo and maybe they should go out and trade for a, court, a qb or start someone else i, I don't know I, I think i would give him another 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 year or so but the main thing is defense to me especially at the cornerback position now, I did want to highlight Jimmy Garoppolo because Trey just brought it up in the chat. Now, if the San Francisco 49ers decided to release Jimmy Garoppolo, they could save up to $24 million in cap space. Okay. So but then- now you, you got to think hypotheticals here because you save up, up to $24 million in cap space. But when you think about it, if you were to go out of free agency and decide to sign another quarterback of free agency, would that would that be an easy transition considering the fact now the the, the start and pay for a quarterback, or I wouldn't say franchise quarterback, but I would probably say a manageable quarterback right now is around 25. yeah, about 25 million. So would it be worth you going out and rolling the dice? and going to get another quarterback in free agency if you did, did decide to make that move? I, I don't believe so, no. I don't believe so. I, I think they should focus on the defensive side. He's not that bad. I don't I don't think that he's – I think they can manage with him. I mean, they made it to the Super Bowl with him. But what, you don't agree? Uh, I think I think durability is an issue, and kind of my opinion is biased because there's a certain quarterback on the roster that I wanted to get an opportunity, so I'm all for him getting cut. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, no, to be honest with you, um, I would love to, I would love to see Kirk Cousins go to San Francisco. Oh, you still on that? Oh, I, yeah, oh my yeah. goodness. <laughs> you, asked, you asked me, right? So I'm giving you my opinion. I, 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 was just, I was just asking you right now. You're still on that? You really want him to go yeah. to San Francisco? Yeah. It's good to have him here think, right now. Dude, I, I, think, I think he will, will – I, mean, I know he did – he put up good numbers, but I think he'll, he'll do even better with Kyle Shanahan. Because, mm. again, he knows – he uh, he was with uh, he was with him at uh, in Washington, right? And the guy drafted. So let me let me let me bring this quarterback scenario to the table here. Um, as far as Deshaun Watson is concerned, do you see that end up working out for the San Francisco 49ers if they decide to make that move? Well, first let's 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 go ahead and draw up a a, a trade package for the San Francisco 49ers to the Houston Texans. All right, I could see this. I could see this. Okay. Um, I read a report where it was two first rounders, a second rounder, and Nick Bosa. Oh, I couldn't do that. I don't know if I could do that. I don't know. I can't. I can't. I can't give up Bosa. Mm-hmm. Bosa, can't, Bosa. That's the anchor of the defense. I can't give up Bosa. He was number. He wasn't there last year, so understandable. But look how good he was in his rookie season. He's only going to get better. 
I know he ended up having a, a season ending knee injury in 2020, but the trajectory was going up as far as Nick Bosa. You can't, you, you, pro, you possibly looking at probably the next most dominant player in, in, in the NFL right now. Uh, I, I say what you call it is. Um, oh, yeah, but, uh, but money wise, Chase Young, okay, yeah. But money wise, would that work with with Deshaun going to the 49ers? Like you said, they're what was the cap again? They're at fifteen point three. But again, they could they could if they decide they to cut Jimmy 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 G, you saving twenty four million. So, and not to mention, um, uh, number one, um, this is what um I heard today. Um, and I heard this from EM. What's up, EM over there? That he's willing to re- restructure his contract. So. And second, his, oh, oh, Jimmy G or 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 or, or. Um, no no um um whoever he sa- goes to uh, uh Watson, Watson. Oh, okay. yeah so because uh, really? Texans is is, is going to be paying all the guaranteed money so they could they he could, if if he wants to he could spread out his contract evenly so the teams won't be getting a big cat pit you know what I mean if he if he does so, that I say four nine is go for it. Go for it. Yeah. If that's true, go for it. My only issue with that is like I have no problem with money because mm-hmm. the cap can always be manipulated. Like some contracts can definitely be restructured. You can you can move some players around. You can cut some players. <laughs> Kyle Van Doy. Uh, but <laughs> my issue is the what you're giving up to get a Deshaun Watson. Now the Dolphins are different because you have a lot of depth to be able to do something like that. But you're looking at if we're looking at the 49ers, I'm not liking Nick Bosa in that in that trade package. That might be yeah. the only way you get him, though. Yeah, that like you, you that's basically the only valuable player that they have on the roster outside of Fred Warner, I'll probably say. Yeah. Thinking off the top of my head. Mm, yeah, that's it. Fred Warner. That's the only like, oh Kittle. Maybe Kittle, but if you were no, to they want out, a defensive player. I'll say they want a defensive player, so it's gotta be both. But you know what? I, I know your boy um Rosen. I know you're talking about the player you're talking about, Rosen. I even that's look, that's how much I like Kyle Shanahan. That I think even Rosen would, would flourish under Kyle Shanahan. That's so I, I don't think San Francisco has a, a quarterback issue because um even when Jimmy Garoppolo's gone. He beat the, the they're beating teams. So you still you gotta think about it though with Nick Mullins and CJ Beathard. Because I, I I watched them play quite a bit over the last couple of seasons. They don't make NFL starter decisions. <laughs> and I feel like in that my, in that Kyle Shanahan, Mike Shanahan offense, as long as you take care of the football and make smart decisions with the football and let your defense do the work, you, you win the game. And oh, obviously, you know, hand the ball off and run the ball football because they're a run they're a run heavy team. But just give give you put Josh Rosen in a system like that where he doesn't have to air the ball out 30 to 40 times a game. I feel like that's a perfect situation for the for for, uh, for Josh Rosen to be with the 49ers. Being with a home team in California. Nah, 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 for the bay. Nah, nah, for the bay. Nah, we don't care what you say. Nah, for the bay. Nah, 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 for the bay. Nah, nah, for the bay. Nah, we don't care what you say. Nah, for the bay. Fire!